What are the top five oh, food spots sh- in Charlotte, North Carolina? What you, what you looking for? You looking for mom and pop? You looking for anything? Five star? Anything? Top like if someone was like, I'm going to Charlotte. I need five spots. I don't care what establishment, what type of food. The five best food spots in Charlotte. So, this is becoming a food truck city. Mm-hmm. So, I'm gonna give two food trucks. A go right now. Okay. First, I'm gonna say Rolos. You ever had Rolos? I haven't. I'm gonna add it to the list. So I got I, a list. I got a list. Yeah. If you ever go to Atlanta, you go to JJ's. You get the the fish and chicken with the crack sauce crack on sauce, it. Crack sauce. Yeah. They got that here now. Okay. We Rolo. got we we got a spot back home called Hip Hop that has that. Okay. Rolos. Rolos is good. It's a truck. Yeah, it's a truck. All Another right. truck. I don't fuck with this girl at all. She got the but she got the best tacos in the city. Her name is Mariah. Mariah's Taco Truck, whatever. You know, we the same age. Went she went to a different high school down or right down the street from mine. Don't got the best relationship with her, but her food is fucking bomb, better than Maria's. That's a that's a tall that, statement. Yes. Okay. I that that I said that because I want you to go. Like, yeah, like I got I'm, you yeah. now because Maria's that's that's my spot. Fig Tree is a low key fine dining. R- Establishment here. It's not the. It's not the. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's not the hype. You know what I mean. So it's not STK, but it's even better. You can go get some elk. You can go get some fig tree. Is amazing for a date night, a celebration, something intimate. Right across from fig tree is Cajun Queen. You been to Cajun Queen? Mm-mm. I got some work to do. Yeah, Cajun Queen Cajun is a Queen. is an entry level date night. Okay. For phenomenal food. Okay. But not over overspending. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? Mom and pop. What is that? That's four? That's four. Okay. So I, the last one I'm gonna do is just straight mom and pop. I'm gonna go Nana, Nana Soul Food. I think where's that at? That's on the south. So right by the airport on York Mount. No, I, I it sounds familiar, but I don't think I Yeah. If one of these spots are open, I'm actually going after this. Okay, yeah. Nana's Soul Food. Nana's might Nana's is closed. You know this Charlotte. But uh everything closed early. Already. Cajun Queen might be closing at eleven. Um Nana's Soul Food. Or I might I might treat myself tomorrow. I, I don't need to eat this late. I'm gonna yeah. treat myself tomorrow though. Cajun Queen is really fucking good. Okay. Really good when you just met something you wanna take her a year yeah. trying to spend four or five hundred dollars. Right. We could eat we could both eat and drink for a hundred dollars and eat really fucking good at Cajun yeah. Queen. You know what I'm saying? Nana's, I threw Nana's in there. A lot of people don't fuck with Nana's, but that's my go to soul food because this is not a soul food city. I lived in Houston for two years. I lived in Miami. I lived in LA. Like I need good soul food. Like mm-hmm. this is it. Just don't do it for me here. Mm-hmm. Like, which is crazy because I was ignorant to that. Yeah, along with a lot of people, like the dude, Mister Chime Time. Like he, when you think of Charlotte, when you hear Charlotte, like a lot of people say it's good soul food out here because it's the South. But you're right. It's a few spots it's, that are really good. Yeah. But majority of spots soul food out here ain't here. Yeah. So what is Charlotte known for? Food wise, because in, in Maryland, DC, and the DMV, we got seafood on lock. We known for our barbecue, but the thing is, like, like that's a that's 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 a white man sport mm-hmm. out here. Plus, y'all's is the vinegar based barbecue, right? Yeah, it's not it's not yeah, the barbecue yeah. I like. I like Texas barbecue, but mm. we known for our barbecue. But but our people not gonna recommend you to that, right? You know what I'm saying? But if if we talking like like just the facts, like yeah, Carolina barbecue is a thing, but I don't indulge in none of that. I wish we had a soul food staple, some type of like I go to Cle- Cleveland, they got the corned beef. You know, when I'm in D.C., they got the mumbo sauce, they mm-hmm. got the carryouts. Mm-hmm. Even the and pizza situation is like, oh, you a, fuck a, with and pizza? Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm yeah. all through. Yeah, bro, and, and pizza cool. You I done been all yeah, through your yeah, town. Yeah, like, yeah, I done yeah. ate every oohs and eyes. Okay, yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I done had every fucking thing. I even done went all the way up to Bethesda before. Before uh, it's it was a, one of the first hot and juicies was in Bethesda. Mm-hmm. And uh, I went out there, and before it was just as regular and normal as it is now, the first one I ever went to, like a, a seafood boil spot, mm-hmm. was in Bethesda. Mm. Annapolis, like, you know, oh, yeah. I, I've the been blue, blue in crabs, every, crab cakes. Yes, I've been yeah. in every crevice of the DMV. That's what's up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we got, 
Oh, wait. So did you... Okay, so what you ain't answered. What is Charlotte known for food-wise? It got to be Carolina barbecue. Okay. We don't really have like no staple fish sandwich or, or no chicken, yeah. like no Nashville yeah. hot. We don't have that. Yeah. We're not right. there yet. So yeah. it would be nice though. I'm trying to think, man. We don't have it. What's up, y'all? And thanks for checking out this Day by Day podcast clip. You can do one of two things. You can either check out another clip from the interview or you can go ahead to check out the full interview itself by clicking on one of the two options provided on the screen. And if you haven't done so, make sure that you subscribe. Thanks.